Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to my channel if you guys are new. I'm so excited because during the month of December, I decided to try to vlog as much as possible. I know a lot of people do vlogmas and I've done it in the past years. But I don't want to put too much pressure on myself to vlog every single day. As of now, I'm thinking every other day, which is still pretty good considering that this year has not been my year for YouTube. I've just been in and out of funks. But I feel like I have so much to vlog this December, especially because if you are new, I bought a house with my boyfriend here in Austin and so we're doing like little renos here and there we're definitely trying to take it slow but we also have like furniture coming in so it's just an exciting time with all that being said our house will probably be a mess like the full month of december so just a disclaimer ryan built our dining room table and the chairs yesterday so boxes are everywhere we had to pull the couch up because we we're actually getting our um like the railing repaired i wanted it to look a little bit more modern and just more simple it had some like outdated molding that i did not love and i impulsively like removed it well i didn't remove it ryan did but i asked him to <laughs> and it was a very impulsive decision speaking of we are going to go get a haircut. I literally woke up and I was just like, no, I can't do this hair any longer. Like, I feel like it just keeps going. And I just want, like, just the dead ends kind of cut off. I wish my hair was, like, thicker all around because I think it would look better. But I saw videos of myself, like, from the back with my hair just, like, all the way back. And it's just, like, a little too long. So I think I'm going to get a little off the ends. And I'll probably just get a wash because like why not? I think it's like 10 bucks extra. When it comes to haircuts, I feel like if I don't get it done that day that I'm like thinking about it, it's not going to happen. So I just need to run with it because I hate getting my hair trimmed. But I know it like actually looks better when I do. And I don't know, I feel like I need to start taking um, like those Vegamore hair gummies. I have them. I'm just so bad at taking them every day. But I definitely need to start doing that because I just want my hair to be like thicker. Like it's long. It grows so fast. But I want my hair to like be super thick. I'm not even going to lie. I already feel like a failure because it is the next day. And here's my haircut. Nothing too different, but honestly when I curled it, I was like, oh my god, it's pretty short because like obviously when it curls, it goes up a little bit, but it just like feels healthy. It looks healthy. It honestly already looks thicker and that's what I wanted, so I'm very happy with it. Curled it today and today we are actually celebrating my birthday for the last time. My birthday was November 25th and it's already December. It's December 1st and so this is the last time I swear you guys, but it is still Sagittarius season. Tonight we're doing a hibachi night in my backyard, which is super exciting because I mean I guess I already had people over for like a little pregame for a day drinking thing tonight's just girls and a hibachi chef is literally coming to my house to like cook for us and do the whole show in my backyard this concept is so cool so I'm definitely gonna vlog it so I had to rent tables and chairs I rented eight foot tables and it was actually just down the road for me so it was nice and these chairs are actually really nice I think I could have gotten the cheaper ones I think they were a couple dollars cheaper but these are just stunning i think they call them garden chairs and then i got these like stretchy table cloths on amazon they were two for 20 and if i bought linens through this company it would have been like 40 dollars extra and then i got these little fly things that spin like that so that when people are eating hopefully the flies are not like all up in their food so they can just turn them on if they want to i got these Honestly, maybe Amazon, but these are being reused for my 25th birthday. The tables and chairs to rent them, I think it was like a little over $50, but we had to rent a truck to like transport them all. So I think that was like 30. It actually turned out looking really nice. I was debating whether or not to do like table mats, like red ones to go with like the kind of hibachi night, but I didn't, but I still like, think it looks really good and look over here ryan put these twinkle lights up for me we literally put them up today because i just did not feel like there was enough light out here um because there's like this one little light when it gets really dark that is not enough obviously the hibachi guy is gonna have like fire so it should be lit up a little bit but i just wanted to make sure that there was a good amount of light we have really nice weather today it's not too cold not too hot so i can still dress for fall and um i feel like this is the cleanest our house has looked in a while <laughs> i feel like i always say this but i love like having friends over and like planning for them to come over because it forces me to get shit done 
and like actually clean my house for once. I got this garland from Trader Joe's and it's so pretty, especially on top of our fireplace. I'm gonna have Ryan light this before he goes. I told him he had to get out of the house because it's only girls tonight. I got these flowers from Trader Joe's and did like a DIY bouquet. I mean, it's not horrible, but <laughs> definitely could be better. I took out all these cocktail glasses because I think I'm gonna try to do like margs. I bought marg mix, but we are low on tequila, so I might have Ryan just like go and grab some really quick. I literally cannot wait for the laundry room to be done. I bought stick and peel tile, peel and stick tile. I have not had a chance to like, put them on, um, but I wanna show you guys the sugar I got from Amazon. I went to um, this uh, bar called Group Therapy. I guess it's a restaurant and a bar. They have this hibiscus like sugar rim or a hibiscus cocktail but the sugar on it is like hibiscus sugar and it is so good it's like addicting so i got this it's hibiscus lime sugar rimmer and i'm gonna put this in a bowl so that we could like rim our drinks with this if they want to i also don't really know exactly what the drinks are gonna be so i think it would be fun to like just try a little bit of everything um because i have marg mix i got um lemon drop mix so we can make lemon drop martinis i also got yuzu juice i've definitely seen like yuzu margaritas at japanese restaurants and i was trying to be a little bit on being with the hibachi thing thank you perfect you read my mind i sent ryan to get tequila i was actually going to text you to get that kind of sleep. wow you think i can do the help before that's a honker um 36 bucks too But, anyways, I told people to arrive here at 6, and it's 6.02, so... You mean 7? Yeah, my friends are kind of always late, and I am too, so it's okay. But, um, that's why I said 6, because the hibachi people are only coming at 6.45, and they're starting at 7. Andy's my first friend that came. Oh. 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 <laughs> Hi! Yay, I'm so excited. What are we going to make? What is that? That's vodka, and I got lemon drop um, mixer. I don't know if you like lemon drop. I love lemon drop. I also got lychee stuff. Mm. Or pretty much. Jeez. Yeah. And margarita oh, stuff is my favorite margarita stuff. Love this shit. I literally had to go hunt for it today. Oh my god. And I like the yuzu. I know. What is that for? Well, I like always hear of like yuzu margaritas. I thought it would be really like tried shit, you know? <laughs> Oh, and then I, I also got this cucumber. Uh, Ooh. Why? Babe, <laughs> I forgot I got tequila. Oh, no. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, tequila doesn't go bad. No, no, I know. I sent him to the store, and he bought this, like, giant bottle. <laughs> when I was like, in front of the house, I was, like, running in really quick to give it to her. I was, like... Over there. Yeah, yeah. 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 Open your mouth and swallow. No, swallow. 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 I don't know how to do that. <laughs> good, right? I think yeah, I agree. It's good. It's good. Yeah, it's good. Oh, sake. Oh, I got so fucked up on sake last night. Last night? Last night? I can't have it again. I'm gonna... Oh, stop whining. You got the different sake. This is better sake. The one you catch it, all of, the, all of them take a shot. I don't know. Can't be that bad, right? What is this? What is this? Just vegetable. Okay. Ready? Ready? One, two, three, and in your mouth. Oh!
One, two, three, and swallow. <laughs> you are welcome. <laughs> Next. I feel like I starved all day for this, Literally except for I the did. I had breakfast. But <laughs> I ate breakfast and then. <laughs> Guys, this is so good. Selfie. Shrimp. It's Sunday and we've been having the most chill Sunday ever, which is so nice, but it is time to get back into like actually doing things because there's so much on our to-do list. Today our number one priority is to get some curtains and Ryan's gonna measure these two um, in our bedroom. And then should we get some downstairs? What do you think? There's only mm -hmm. one wall. What wall? One across from on the, the couch. TV? Yeah. Or maybe you want some in the dining room too or no? Mm, we can always do that later. Why? When we like pick out the um, chandelier and stuff, and, like finish the dining room. Mm, kind of a little like longer and also like taller. We should get ones that go to the ceiling or something. You know how curtains like have pleats in them? Pleats? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so we'll get like two panels. Is this taller? Mm, no. Probably taller, like Is up to the taller? ceiling. What? Yeah, go higher. I want them like all the way to the ceiling. Looks weird. No, I swear. It makes the bedroom look bigger. Why did Ryan just make fun of me for having the Target app on my phone? <laughs> I think we're gonna get these at Target. And this is why I have it, because I wanna check if it's in stock. And it is. So, I think we're gonna get five of these for this bedroom because we need one, two, three, four. And then this window by my bed. I cleaned the kitchen earlier this morning, so everything's nice and shiny, but I need a little Diet Coke because I'm losing energy right now, even though I had coffee today. This Target is massive. We're gonna see what they say about Sophie because I don't think that dogs are allowed in here, but I guess we'll see. I decided this Target is superior. We're in South Park and they have like everything in stock. I feel like this section's always like really empty. They have a lot of options, but there's not a lot of quantity of each option. And I really like like the sheer ones, but if we close these, are they gonna be enough during the night? I love this material too. You have to pick. Which one? Which one? Okay, we'll do the white. I'm not a huge fan, but... She likes the one. No. I already said this one, they're pretty good. Yeah, but she didn't lick it twice. We actually just had a little snack at the tables that are um, here for my party. I just like took off the tablecloths and put it in the wash, but we are returning them tomorrow because I don't think they were like open on the weekends. We got them on Friday and we're returning them on Monday. The weather is just so nice outside that I literally just bought a hammock. It says it should be delivered this coming week, so I'll definitely update you guys on the vlogs, but it's like a really nice one with a wooden um, stand. And the fabric part is like this quilted material, so I feel like it's gonna be so comfy and I used to love going around the hammocks in our apartment on a nice day It was just like my favorite thing to just like literally lay there and like Sophie would be in the hammock with me And we have no outdoor furniture So at least we'll have somewhere to sit if we want to be outside We do have um, our love seat glider that's upstairs and we keep forgetting to sit out there We put a fire pit and everything our balcony is on our front part of our house So I guess we just really don't like think to sit out there, but we need to because so nice with the fire on but anyways i wanted to show you guys the curtains that we got so we ended up going with this white color i did kind of want the taupe but i feel like this will look really nice too this is just like a sheer one it's not the blackout ones and we got it in the like longer size so that was 95 but 95 is like the whole length of one wall over here so i'm actually gonna have to drop these off to a tailor to get hemmed. I'm really curious how much it's gonna cost me because I have to do four of these and I honestly need to do some research because I have no idea where to get them hemmed. I also decided that I do want to rotate the dining table. I said this in the last vlog and we're just gonna see what it looks like. 
Oh my gosh. she was what was that you guys <laughs> i feel like i just had the pit me to like turn it now we need to get a rug i've also seen these like beautiful china cabinets they're also called hutches on facebook marketplace and like some are really expensive some are more affordable i would absolutely love to like refinish one and like sand the stain off of one because i think those are so beautiful and it just like takes up more space or we could get like just kind of like some more storage here because like the more storage, the better. So I'll probably hang the mirror up somewhere and then maybe like some pictures. I'm not really sure. I feel like I want to like actually hang up art. I kind of just want to wait till like all the furniture is in the house and then we can like start thinking about that. I also want to start like actually shopping for home goods when we travel to places, um, specifically like out of the country, which I guess we haven't really traveled out of the country that often, just me and Ryan. But when we do start to, which will hopefully happen in the next couple of years, I feel like it would be really cool to like get, you know, a piece of art from wherever we go or like a vase from where, wherever we go. So that's obviously later down the road and like we'll start collecting things, but it's definitely more sentimental to do it that way. So, but for now we'll have lots of empty walls except for mirrors everywhere. I feel like I have like a ton of mirrors, which I'm not complaining about because I love them. <laughs> 